Hey, it's John with Pat Business Masters, and I'm gonna show you a great way on how to plan your daily route so you can get from all your dog walking and pet sitting customers in the quickest and most efficient way possible. We're gonna do that with Google Maps. So go to Google Maps and uh, we'll start there. So go to Google Maps and make sure you're signed in to your own Google account too because we're gonna save this map to uh, your account. So once you're at Google Maps, go to the menu and go to your places and then we're gonna go to maps and here's a bunch of saved maps I've already made but we're gonna create a new map and let's call this map Tuesday's schedule and we're gonna save that and the next thing we're gonna do is just start adding the uh, locations that we need to go to. Now you don't have to add them in any particular order, just throw in all the destinations you need to get to and then we'll plan a route later. So let's just start with the first address that we need to go to. So let's start here. And once we have that plotted, click add to map so we can permanently save that to our map and we see it shows up right over here. Now let's add a second location and dropped a new pin there. So let's add this one to our map and let's add a third location as well. Let's do that, add to map. Now we can't see all three of these at the same time because we're too zoomed in. So let's go to the zoom tool, zoom out until we can see all our destinations on the same map. There we go. So here we see location one, two, and three. And you see when we hover over them, it actually shows up here in the left-hand column, okay? Now, this is a great way to visually see where all the destinations are. And in this case, we can obviously see that it's gonna be a very straight line from one to the next to the next. Now, if you had a case where you had a bunch of destinations all in one little area and you weren't quite sure, exactly which to go to first, a great way to figure that out is to click on a starting point and then click on directions and then over here start typing in uh, another address on our map. So let's try this one on Balton Court and now we're going to see it's planned a route for us here. But we don't know how long it's going to take so click on these options click on step-by-step -step directions, and then we see it's showing that it's gonna be five miles and 12 minutes to get from point A to point B. Now in this case, it's very obvious that we're just gonna go from one place to the other, but again, if you had a bunch of locations all around in the same area, you could do a little bit of trial and error and see how long it takes to get from one to another, and then from one to a different one, just to see exactly which is gonna be the shortest route. One of the great things about Google Maps is it tells you down to the minute how long it's going to take you. So it's a very, very good way to plan uh, which direction you're gonna go. So that's about it. So when you have your daily route, put it on a map here, figure out the best way to get from home to home, and you'll be able to accomplish these visits as quickly as possible. Thanks for watching.